Welcome back everybody. So girls and boys, I hope that you have had a delicious treat and I hope that you've washed your hands. Right, girls and boys, who likes to eat carrots? I do. Okay, so carrots are very good for our eyes. They help us to see better. Okay, girls and boys, today for our fun activity, we're going to be doing carrot counting. Did I say carrot counting? I did. Right. We're going to need two colors of paper. The first one is a green paper and the second one is orange because we need carrots. Okay. But what happens if you don't have colored paper? That's okay. All you need to do is take your crayons and color it in. And then if you don't want to use your crayons, that's okay. Maybe ask mommy to help you take some food coloring. I did say food coloring. Put it in a bowl, mix it with some water and then paint your paper. One needs to be yellow. I didn't say yellow, I said green. Good. And the other one needs to be pink. I did not say pink, I said orange. Good job. Right guys. So the next thing that we need to do is mommy needs to help us cut out. Right, and I'm going to show you what shape is this everybody? Correct. This is a triangle and it's a big long triangle. So mommy's going to help you cut out five triangles. Okay, and then girls and boys you're going to take your green paper and you're going to cut them up into strips just like this. Now, girls and boys, I know how smart you are. And this is really easy peasy lemon squeezy. So you can actually tear them yourself. Mommy doesn't really need to cut them. So you can cut, you can tear the paper just like this. There we go. There we go. There we go. Right? And then you tear it again. Ta-da! There we have right now the fun begins so girls and boys you're going to need some press stick or some glue stick and then put your carrots down onto i almost forgot onto a nice big sheet of white paper if you don't have white paper that's also okay maybe use an empty cereal box if you cut it open you can use it just like that and then girls and boys if you look over here so we have one carrot and you know what this is called? This is called a stem. So we're going to take one stem and we're going to put it under just like that. Can you see? Good job. Now we're going to put it down. Then we're going to take our second carrot and now we have two carrots. Can you see here? If you come closer, I can show you. Right. So that's one carrot and that's one stem. Then we're going to take two stems and we're going to push it inside and push it inside. So now we have two stems, right? And then we're going to continue. So teacher Nadi has been busy already. There's our third carrot. One, two, three. So that means we have to push it inside. One, let's go again, two, and the last one is three can you see and then we carry on building so let's continue so we're going to continue all the way until we get to five carrots and five stems so we're almost there guys so let's push it inside and then you're going to see what our carrots look like they actually look very good i think teacher Megs and i are going to have a carrot party we can have some carrots to eat so guys this is what your creative activity is going to look like for today. See, so let's count. That's one, two, three, four, and five. And we put all the stems inside. Okay, guys, so I hope you have lots of fun making your art for today. Remember to send us pictures or maybe videos. We'd love to see how you actually built it. And until tomorrow, guys, we love you. Bye, guys.